people talk about career to me, you know, your career sometimes, and it's just a word that I don't use. I don't think in terms of commercial or career or... You mean you find yourself, because you do music and, it's, and a lot of people find room for it all over the world, or people find space for it, people enjoy it, people relate to it, uh, you find yourself in the music business, which is quite different from music. For instance, when I met Mark, he was he was playing in a rockabilly band, just playing the guitar, and he and he had songs that he wanted to do himself, and he he wanted a vehicle for those songs, yeah. and by meeting in a you know in in a certain circumstances, you find the sort of people that you can actually make that thing happen with, and then it just sort of yeah, it's a feel thing, that. you know, it's a. It's just a, a field thing. You know that the time is there. In many ways, success came late for you fellows. I mean, you're now in your 30s. Why couldn't you have had the success at, say, 20? You have to start somewhere. I mean, we started playing guitars when we were 15, 14, 15 years of age. And suddenly and you start, something starts to happen with your guitar playing and your feeling for music in a big way when you're about 25 or 26. There's no rules about it. I mean, some people do actually manage to kick off pretty early. Uh, I know, as it happened, about the second album time, we'd been touring a lot and we were all, you know, pretty, pretty much frazzled, you know, we, uh, fried up. And uh, I think that uh, if, if we'd been 20 then, I don't think that we would have made it. Mark, in, in talking to you, I get the feeling that perhaps you're not a performing type person. Is it difficult for you to get up on stage? I enjoy it. I enjoy it performing. Mm. It satisfies a certain side of your character too. You can get an incredible release from being up there. You know, it's almost I'm sort of like it, almost like the making love, you know, this is another this is not a kids program, but it's like that. It's like it's really a very sort of sensational thing sometimes. And it's an incredibly physical thing. It makes you makes you feel really good inside. I mean I'm not one of those um artists, you know, who uh, who regards their performance as a favour to the audience. I, I kind of like to think of it in uh, as just as much the other way around, where uh, the audience are favouring you by, by coming. And, um, it's a mutual, it's very much a mutual thing. And the, the audience is very much, uh, the people who are really into the music are very much a part of the performance. <laughs>